A Florida Police Department's website has a mission statement that says, quote, the Miami Gardens Police Department is committed to building a better tomorrow through community interaction. But the department is coming under fire for the way that it's interacting with the community after being accused of systemic harassment at a convenience store and one man in particular. Police reports show that 28-year-old Earl Sampson has been stopped and questioned by police in Miami Gardens 258 times in four years. He's been searched more than 100 times and arrested and jailed 56 times. The most serious offense Sampson committed was possessing a small amount of marijuana. But according to the police, 62 arrests were prompted by trespassing. However, there's one small problem. Sampson is the clerk at the same convenience store he was repeatedly stopped and frisked at. The 207 Quick Stop owner had signed up for a zero tolerance program giving police broad powers to stop and arrest people in and around his store. He quickly regretted it and took down the sign showing he was a participant. After repeated incidents with police, the owner of the convenience store decided to document what was happening by installing 15 video cameras in his shop last year. The videos show cops stopping people, arresting them, and using excessive force for no apparent reason. Now, the shop owner and his attorney are preparing to file a federal civil rights lawsuit against a police department they say is participating in illegal activity.